Hello to all of our WHS students and families. I'm Dennis Mahoney, principal of the Winchester High School. And with me as always, our assistant principal Paula Conis and John Dupuy. While this was certainly not the spring or summer that we expected, we do hope all of our WHS families were able to find some time for rest and relaxation. We spent most of our summer at WHS trying to figure out how to change almost everything we've ever done. And we were excited to show everyone how much we were able to get done in such a short amount of time. The global pandemic and overall shutdown has certainly pushed many of us out of our comfort zones. But the optimist in me is always reminded that being outside of our comfort zone is where we grow the most. This year will certainly require a lot of patience and flexibility in all areas. We appreciate your compassion and understanding. We anticipate that there will be bumps along the way, but we are committed to getting students back to WHS in the safest, happiest, and healthiest way possible. The return to school in the fall after summer break is something we eagerly look forward to every year because this building just isn't the same without you here with us. Our extended time out of the building has made this year's return that much more special. It may look a little, all right, a lot different, but we could not be more excited to be getting back together again and to be greeting your masked faces every morning again. I know for the three of us, we just want to have students back in WHS and give you and us some sense of routine and support. Of course, we want to make sure this happens in the safest way possible. We've walked the hallways, measured classroom space. We've tried to envision where you can safely eat lunch. We want you back in your school to grow, to learn, and be challenged. Being that we will all be wearing our masks, we've been practicing our hand signals as best we can, such as, hello. Our Monday morning hello. Our Friday goodbye. Great job. You're late to school, again. You're wandering the hallways, again. In all seriousness, we are so, so, so excited to be back at WHS. We have missed you, and we know that you share our excitement in getting back to school. Things will be different this year, and not all the differences will be things that you like. Please know that we agree with you, and also don't like some of the changes. But we want you to know that we are committed to keeping you safe and getting Winchester High School back to the business of being one of the best schools in the world. We made this video for you to view and better understand the large changes that we have in place for you at WHS. We hope that you enjoy it and repeat after us. Do, Do your, your part. part. The staff and administration at Winchester High School would like to take this opportunity to inform students and their families of the procedures we put in place to help ensure safety for all as we return to the classroom. Please be sure you are familiar with these procedures as they will impact your daily routine and your overall school experience. We urge all students and families to do your part. You'll notice that things have changed as soon as you arrive for school. All doors will be locked and remain locked until 9.15 every morning. Students must not gather in large crowds before entering and you must wear a mask at all times while you are on the campus at WHS, unless you are taking a designated mask break. How you arrive at school will dictate how you enter school. If you are driving, You'll need to park in the student lot, pass through the tunnel, down the walk, and into the gymnasium door, door seven. Any student dropped off or walking from the Swanton Street side or back side of the building will enter via door 15. Walkers and bike riders arriving from the Skillings Road or front side of the building will enter through door 21. <music> Lastly, parents may drop off students at the front of the building in the bus drop off area. Those students will enter using the main door, door one. Breakfast will still be available for those who need it, but on a grab and go basis. Students eating breakfast should do so in the designated eating area in the gym or outside. The dining commons will not be available in the morning. Once inside, students should be ready to report directly to their first class. You'll notice that much like stories you've recently been to, there is one-way traffic posted throughout the school on floors and walls. Some hallways will be one-way only, 
some staircases will be designated for going up only, while some will be for going down only. Please do your part by following all the correct paths while moving throughout the building. You will have extra time between classes to get where you need to go. Lunch breaks are going to be a challenge. Lunch will still be available for purchase at WHS, but only as a grab-and-go option. You won't be able to make special lunch requests. Lunch will be a contactless experience, and you must use your student ID for purchases. Incoming freshmen and new students will be provided with a sticker with a barcode until IDs are available. Because we must abide by social distancing guidelines, we can't fit as many students into the dining commons as we have in the past. Students can eat lunch in the dining commons, in the dining areas set up in the gymnasium, or at any outside space. Only students in grades 11 and 12 may leave the campus for lunch. Common microwave ovens and vending machines have been removed, and outside delivered lunches of any kind will not be accepted at the front desk. Don't forget to do your part by using the hand washing stations available at the dining commons and the gymnasium, or wash your hands in the bathrooms prior to your lunch. WHS will attempt to use the entire campus for student and teacher activities, and that includes outside spaces. Classes will be encouraged to work outside as long as weather permits. Students are welcome to be anywhere outside while still on campus when they have a designated remote learning class or lunch. Students may request a mask break at the two outside mask break areas. Your mask break should not be longer than five minutes. Please be thoughtful and judicious when choosing to take a break. Even something as small as using the bathroom will come with certain restrictions. We do encourage you to wash your hands several times throughout the day, but each bathroom will have a maximum occupancy sign on the door and we expect you will respect these occupancy numbers. No more than three students should be in the restrooms on the second and third floor, and the larger restrooms on the first floor will accept no more than five students at a time. Restrooms will receive cleaning and attention in the daytime and will be sanitized further during off hours. Do your part by making your trips to the bathroom only when necessary, and remember, no congregating in the bathroom at any time. All students will be asked to do your part when it comes to disinfecting. Hand sanitizing stations will be available in hallways and in every classroom that does not have direct access to an internal water source. There will also be disinfecting spray bottles located in every classroom. Students are responsible for disinfecting their desks, chairs, and other used surfaces when they are done using them. Students are welcome to also disinfect surfaces before using them. As usual, medical care is available for students who don't feel well during the school day. Students may visit the nurse during the day for any ailments, and a special medical waiting area will be set up in room A116. Any student exhibiting symptoms of COVID-19 or significant illness should immediately report to A116. Your parents or guardian will be called to pick you up immediately. If you display these symptoms before you come to school, please stay home. The main office will be closed during the day to all outside foot traffic. All parent visits or meetings should be done over the phone or Zoom. If you need to contact someone in the main office, simply call them. <laughs>